Welcome back to YouTube channel Master Auto Information. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Let's get into today's video. Today, we're diving into one of the most talked about utility aircraft in the modern aviation landscape the 2025 Harbin Y-12. This Chinese-made twin-engine turboprop aircraft has gained attention globally for its upgraded performance, versatility, and modern avionics. Whether you're an aviation enthusiast, a pilot, or just curious about what's new in the skies for 2025, this aircraft is definitely worth knowing. First, let's take a quick look at the background of the Harbin Y-12. Originally developed by Harbin Aircraft Industry Group under the Aviation Industry Corporation of China, the Y-12 series has been in production since the 1980s. It was initially created as a replacement for older Soviet-designed aircraft and to serve as a multi-role platform for both civil and military aviation. Over the years, the Y-12 has undergone various upgrades and redesigns to meet international aviation standards and modern operational requirements. Now, fast forward to 2025, and we have the latest iteration. The Harbin Y-12F Advanced. This new variant builds upon decades of proven utility aircraft experience, and it brings some serious updates that make it highly competitive in the modern turboprop segment. One of the biggest improvements in the 2025 version is its engines. The aircraft is now powered by two Pratt Whitney Canada PT-6A65B turboprop engines. These are well known in the aviation industry for their reliability efficiency, and power output. With each engine producing over 1,100 shaft horsepower, the Y-12F Advanced now offers better takeoff performance, improved climb rates, and a higher cruise speed compared to its predecessors. Speaking of performance, let's look at some numbers. The maximum cruising speed is now around 520 km per hour or roughly 280 knots. The range has also been extended to approximately 1,800 kilometers with a full payload, making it suitable for regional flights and inter-island operations. The maximum service ceiling has been increased to about 30,000 feet, which provides more flexibility for different weather conditions and operational profiles. Another significant upgrade in the 2025 Y-12 is its avionics suite. The aircraft now comes equipped with a fully digital glass cockpit featuring a Garmin G3000 system, autopilot integration, terrain awareness, and enhanced weather radar. This is a huge step forward from older analog cockpits, offering better situational awareness for pilots and reducing workload especially on long flights or in challenging environments. From a design perspective, the Y-12F Advanced retains its high-wing configuration, which is ideal for short takeoff and landing operations. The wingspan has been slightly increased to improve aerodynamic performance, and the winglets have been reshaped for better fuel efficiency. The fuselage is still boxy but functional allowing for easier cargo loading and passenger access. The aircraft can carry up to 19 passengers or roughly 3,500 kilograms of cargo, making it extremely versatile for multiple rollers or whether it's used for air ambulance, cargo delivery, surveillance, or passenger transport. Another cool feature is its improved stall capabilities a short takeoff and landing. Thanks to its reinforced landing gear, upgraded flaps, and high lift wing design, the 2025 Y-12 can take off and land on runways as short as 600 meters. This makes it perfect for remote airstrips, mountain areas, or undeveloped regions where larger aircraft can't operate safely. Let's also talk about the aircraft's build and durability. The Y-12 has always been known for its ruggedness, and the 2025 version continues that legacy. The airframe has been strengthened with corrosion-resistant alloys and reinforced joints. It's designed to operate in extreme environments of from Arctic tundra to tropical climates. And because it has simple systems and accessible maintenance panels, it's easy to repair and maintain even in field conditions. One major focus in the 2025 upgrade is noise and vibration reduction. The cabin has been redesigned with better insulation materials, 
and new propeller blades have been introduced to reduce acoustic footprint. This makes the ride quieter and more comfortable for both passengers and crew, which is a big deal for commercial operators and charter services. Safety is another area where the 2025 Harbin Y12 shines. The latest version complies with ICAO and ESA safety standards. It now features dual redundant flight control systems, advanced navigation aids, and real-time engine monitoring. The aircraft is also equipped with enhanced emergency locator transmitters and automatic dependent surveillance air broadcast, or ADSB for better tracking and coordination with air traffic control. On the business side of things, the 2025 Harbin Y-12 is attracting attention from airlines, military forces, and humanitarian agencies alike. Operators are praising its low operating costs, excellent fuel economy, and multi-role flexibility. It's cheaper to run compared to jets, and because of its ability to land almost anywhere, it opens up routes that were previously inaccessible by larger aircraft. International interest is growing too. Several African, South American, and Southeast Asian countries have already placed orders or expressed interest. The aircraft is being marketed as a low-cost alternative to more expensive Western models like the Dornier 228 or the Viking Twin Otter, without sacrificing modern features or reliability. For those of you wondering about pricing, while exact numbers depend on the configuration and optional systems, estimates place the 2025 Y12F advanced in the range of 7 to 10 million USD. That's quite competitive when you consider the performance, capacity, and updated avionics on board. And finally, Let's not forget the green aspect. In an era where aviation is under pressure to reduce emissions, the Y-12F Advanced offers a more fuel-efficient option for regional transport. There are even discussions about a future hybrid electric version being developed, although that's still in early RD stages. So, to sum it all up at the 2025 Harbin Y-12 is a solid upgrade of a proven utility aircraft, with better engines, modern avionics improved range, and excellent stall capabilities, it stands out in a crowded market. It's rugged, flexible, and affordable, making it a great choice for both developing and developed aviation markets. Whether you're into planes or just love learning about cutting-edge transport tech, the Y-12 is worth keeping an eye on. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to Master Auto Information and tap the bell icon so you never miss an update. Drop a comment below and let me know what aircraft you want us to cover next. See you in the next video.